Hey peeps. It's uh Halloween. I played this game, The Last Door, on a, like a tablet or an iPad. I played the whole thing and it was a lot of fun. Never got to see season two. Now it's on a PlayStation. So I don't know. Somebody else see season two. I figure it's Halloween. Let's uh check this out again. It's been a while. And already look at this. The the title screen. Fucking crazy cool. Crazy cool looking. For all the things that I've seen. Oh yeah. <laughs> not interested in all this stuff. This is a chair. These are all the things that I've done. Oh, shit. I cannot escape the course my life has taken. It's been a while since I played this game, so. <laughs> hmm. I am beyond redemption. I just hope you can forgive me someday. I'll turn this down just a little bit. Oh shit. Don't do it, son. Yours sincerely, Anthony Beachwood. No, dude. Get down here. Oh, son. The last door. I don't want to skip it. I love the art in this game. October 1891. Uh, what's that say? Was that the queen? What's that say? Is this in fucking English? Okay. <laughs> you never know. Uh, that was all my childhood friend. Anthony Beachward had written in his letter. Well, what the fuck does it mean? 
it had been many years since I had heard that sentence. It was the motto of the science and philosophy group that we had secretly run as students. Back then, we were in that <clears throat> secluded board school in Scotland, where we had left it all behind, like weird childhood memories. The letter was unusual. It could only mean something awful must have happened. Something that must remain absolutely secret. Don't burn it. I had to find out what was going on. Without delay, I took the first morning train to Sussex, made my way to the address on the letter. And there it was, the old house of Anthony's family, the Beechworth Manor. Episode one, the letter. I never know if I'm supposed to like hit something or if it's gonna go into it. Cause I don't want to skip anything, but I'm hitting, hitting the button now. Hmm. Weird looking dude. This is strange. Everything is silent, as if there's no one living here. I'm worried about Anthony. I have to find him. Is this Anthony? The years have not been kind of him. Shut my tongue, cunt. A note on the table. Dear Mr. Beechworth, due to the recent events, the situation has become unbearable for us. Much to our regret, we have no other choice but to leave. We will remain forever grateful for all the years of your service. God bless you, Mr. and Mrs. Brewer. Hmm. Bitches. Rampart right o'clock. It's the only sound around here. Uh, go this way. This way, bruh. No. Of course not. It's too dark. I can't go any further. Of course you can. God damn it. <clears throat> fucking go downstairs. I wanted you to pick up this fucking candle. Kevin with glass and some liquor bottle. There's also a matchbox. Take the fucking matchbox. These matches could come in useful. Yeah, motherfucker. Yeah. A machine that plays record music. I didn't know that Anthony was such an enthusiast. <coughs> was such an enthusiast of new inventions. recording of sound where music can be played if an engraved cylinder or a disc is inserted but I see no such object in device in this device hmm. Hmm. A fireplace it looks like it has not been cleaned for a long time judge Judgy. 
Large window is wide open, letting the cold dust air in. Close it, motherfucker. A rainy mountain landscape. A seascape. There's a small boat struggling against the roaring waves. Oh, not yet. Who's this? This portrait is crooked. Who is it? There you go. Did I just get that? No, no. Whoa, shit. You know, rosary, a cord of beads with a solid wooden crucifix. Thanks, bro. This painting depicts a deep, dark forest. Oh, man. A small plant will bring some life to this place. Oh, I can't see. Can I... Let's go this way first. Oh, there's another one. What's this? A variety of herbs and ingredients. Get the stove and cleaning glass. A plate with some <coughs> days old leftovers. Gross. Plates and pans. the door. What? So it was locked before, I guess. Oh, shit. Let's, huh, hold on. The garbage bin. Judging by the foul order, I would say it's not been emptied in a fortnight. Wow. Hmm. Oh, I didn't want to go that way. Oh, I didn't know you could go that way. My TV is zoomed in like an inch too far on each border. God damn it. A murder of crows is eating eagerly. There's so many birds that I cannot see their prey from here. Huh. That's fucking gross. Go back in the goddamn house. Yeah. Let's, well, uh. We ain't uh, supposed to be here yet. Please. A wash basin and some toilet trees. There's nothing of interest in the drawers. Okay, what about this? A lamp to light the way, yes. Take the motherfucker. Yes. Oh, I can't see. Use it. I don't know how to use it. Fuck. I don't know. Wait. A tiny dark hole in the wall. Maybe he just automatically uses it if he wants to. I don't know. Ooh. 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 Okay. It's right here. March 5th, 1891. Master Anthony has made us get rid of our religious objects. What's going on with him? Luckily, I have found a place to hide my rosary. 
<clears throat> I cannot pray every night without it. Stupid. May 10th, 1891. Master Anthony has been complaining about Alfie. What would a simple cat do when he ordered to keep him out of the house at all times? Still, I cannot let the poor thing starve. He's such a clever cat. Every time I open the window, he knows food is waiting for him. Anyway, I'm worried about Master Anthony. He's growing more and more like him, unlike himself every day. September 15, 1891. Master Anthony is spending whole days locked inside his office. He wants us to leave him food at the door, but he barely eats anything. I'm really worried. Hmm. Fucking. There's a discoloration on the wall in the shape of a cross, as if one had hung there for many years and recently been removed. A whale. Cat box. I think. An empty bowl. Like the ones used to feed pets on. It's not a cat box. Never mind. <clears throat> the window is so dirty that I can barely see through the out to the outside. Huh. Well, fucking wash it. Oh, we opened it, motherfucker. Good. The cold wind of the evening is a relief on the suffocating atmosphere. Oh. out here. Looks like the window frame is rotten. We need some kind of cord to hold the window open. Okay, well. Oh, it's a rosary thing. Oh, that fucking worked? Huh. Well, uh, now what? Oh, maybe I should have examined it again. Dang it. Oh, well. Too late. Um, what's this? A small plant brings some life to this place. Close door. The door is locked. Let's try to find the key to open it. Oh, okay. Heart deep forest, huh? Let me, can I examine out the window now that it's open? The cold wind of the evening is a relief in this suffocating atmosphere. Like, yeah, that's it, huh? Yeah, let's go back. Oh shit. The large window is wide open, letting the cold dusk air in. Uh, I'm, just, I'm okay with it, I guess. Fireplace. It looks like it has not been cleaned in a long time. <laughs> Fucking clean it, asshole. Then all I need is matches to progress. I don't know. What does it say again? Grandfather Cloud. It's the only sound around here. Yeah. My coat. It's Anthony. I've been kind of well. They haven't been kind to of you either, son. Oh, stop. Stop. There. Hold on. Matchbox. Into the lamp. Oh, fucking. I'm not very smart. God damn it. There. No, not your coat. Alright, god damn it. Let's go. Oh, no, I got it. Nice. This game is so fucking cool, man. I'll never forget playing it, just sitting up in my bed, 
playing this on the old either tablet or iPad, I can't remember. I paid like 15 bucks for it. The story has been boarded up. I don't remember what I paid for it on PlayStation. Uh, but it was just season one. And I was more than fucking happy with it. Oh shit. What's this? A silver key. Damn, take the motherfucker. Thank you. Where did the fireplace is black with soot? Clean the motherfucker. A gentleman with serious and inquisitive look. Okay. <sighs> Small photographs and old daguerreotypes. Mostly familiar portraits of what? Daguerreotypes. Daguerreotypes. Oh, the girl might be the 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 gear uh, the Daguerre process? Uh, fuck, I don't know. The guy who created photographs. I don't know. Look it up. This one leads to the balcony. Straight with the adjacent room. Fucking go out there. It's locked. Stop, wait. No, what the f Stop. Okay, lock. Come on. Where's my thing? Window locked. I cannot open the hatch. It's just stuck. Perhaps I could <clears throat> do so using a small tool. Oh, like a fucking key? The key's too thick. Need something thinner to remove the latch. Okay. We'll come back. We'll come back then, bruh. We got another door to look at. This one. <coughs> Close the door. It's locked from the inside, huh? Get it. There was one door we could use that key on. Yeah. Uh, was it? Door stuck. It won't open. We didn't even try to open that. Okay. Did I not try to open this? No. Okay, well, go back, go. This game was all touch controls, and you know, it was actually easier to play on touch controls. Because if I wanted to go somewhere, I'd be like, touch, 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 you know. I don't know, it's a bit different with the thumbstick. Let's go find that locked door. Did that go both ways? Yeah, I mean, Okay. Oh, this, I didn't look at this. Oh, I did. God bless me. God bless America. Get out of here. Come on, idiots. Start walking. Walk to the fucking door. Unlatching. Good job, bro. Did I just go down and... Hold on. 
Oh, so that's the basement stairs. Okay. There's another game that's kind of cool, like this. No, it's not as good. Called Home. I like Home. It, I mean, it's just not as good. I think this is a slate disc uh, record. The sleeve reads The Carnival of Venice. Okay. I can pick it up. Thanks, bro. What's this? Crowbar. I bet ya. A slightly rusted iron crowbar, yeah. Take it. I bet it breaks in one use, huh? The boiler looks like it has been out of use for a long time. Well. Small fire fire with twigs and chunks of dry bark. Okay. Go back. Hmm. Okay. Oh, let me light the furnace. No, okay. Let me. I used for a long time. I just came down for the fucking crowbar, I guess. Keep going. Get no, go go here. I can't see. Is there a way to go here? No, I guess not. Okay, go up here. Go. On. Let's go play our record, there, son. This ain't the. Is this it? Washburn's and toiletries. What was the record? I bet the record's right there, huh? Hells yeah. Awful music, it says. be broken. I do not know how, how to make it stop. Oh. The music has abruptly stopped. Okay. Can I break through that door with the crowbar now? Well, that was stuck. Stuck, it won't open. Okay. How about this? How about try again? Nope. Okay. Oh, one. Duh. Left-handed, I was going to first. What's in there? We've already been up here. Right? Lock from the inside. All right. Closed door. Door stuck. It won't open. God damn it! Should I have used that on the with the crowbar instead? Fuck. Fucking be dead, man. 
Hurry up, man. Oh, shit. Grows flat. Get out of here, man. Are they still there? Oh, dang it. Oh, come here. No. I don't know what to do, Captain. Play it with some deal left over. Well, I'll go get them. You feed them to the crows? Take it. Fried herbs and ingredients. Well. Shit. Duh. We're probably gone now. Yep. Oh no. It's a dying crow lying amidst a puddle of blood. Uh. What the fuck? I took him. That's so sick. The remains of the banquet. Uh, hold on. Oh, is that thing moving? God damn it. Uh, stop crying. See if I can fireplace. Like it's not been clean for a long time. Go in there. Okay. The crow on the thing. Okay. I would. <laughs> I would better leave it alone. Okay. Can I my glasses? Look at bottles. Oh, I know where to go. Uh, I just came out of there. Let's go put the crow in the cat box. Or, not the cat box. Whatever I was calling the cat box. Go. Um, not this one. Where is it? Who has no memory? God dang it. Uh, not there. Go here. Don't go there. No, this fucking lock. Dang it. Go here. My God, what has happened here? Leave me alone. Did I not come in this room? Left this body of a woman who has been here for a few days. Looks like she is clutching a note in her hand. Let's have it, babe. I'm writing what will surely be my last thoughts. My last line is my last breath. I do not know what kind of dark power has turned my husband into what he is now, a stranger. With a look bare of all sanity, compassion, and human warmth, I do not know what shadow has slowly darkened our lives. Thank God. I do not know this foreign guest that now dwells in our souls. I gotta get rid of that subtitle thing. 
<clears throat> I do not know where it is from, but I am sure it is from this world. I will meet my brothers and sisters soon. I will be free from this abyss of madness and fear. Soon I will stop trembling. Huh. Give me that bitch. A simple long hairpin. Okay, take it. What's this? It's a letter. Dear Margaret, it's been days since Anthony left his office. I can hear him whisper angrily, frightfully. It gets worse at night. Our service left a few days ago. Without their help and company, I'm lost. I can probably walk out of bed and not eat. Then the doctor will come <coughs> after his argument with Anthony. My husband has developed a horrible ability to break anyone's will. I do not know what to do. I do not have any strength left. I wish I could send you this letter, your dear friend. And a piece for it. Come on, come on. It's right on the walls, reads, Leave me alone. Who would have written such a thing? Oh, I don't know. Dying crow. Diary page. I cannot stand their stares. They, they watch me. They judge me. They despise me. I know they think I'm not worthy of this family. But who are they but dust and bones? A memory, leave me. I do not need you. Leave me alone. Take it. God damn. I want you to take the motherfucker. A letter in, a, in feeble handwriting. I cannot go on. All is lost. An old wheelchair. Let me get interest on this dressing table. Okay. In the walls it reads, leave me alone. Who have written such a thing? Okay. strong features and dark hair. She has a bold look in her eyes. I bet she does. The young Anthony. Just like I remember him. Hmm. She looks like the woman on the bed. Who's holding the baby? Could that be Anthony's child? Fuck, I don't know. This old man bears some resemblance to Anthony. But his <laughs> contentence is marred by a severe unsettling gaze okay this young woman not yet in her 20s stares defiantly back at me a man with blood <coughs> with blonde hair sorry I feel as if I have seen him before maybe you have Portrait of Anthony staying beside a mounted wildcat or lynx. The paint looks fresher around the animal's head. Hmm. There's a big raven. Perch outside the window, tapping on the glass with his beak. Well, fuck off, Mr. Raven. All you need to do is find the room where to put this crow. Fuck, I already walked past it. God damn it. stuck it won't open. Of course not. Well, let's try the fucking hairpin. Was there one over here? Dang it. 
might have been one over here. Close door. It's locked from the inside. Son of a fucking fucker. God bless it. Come here. Do this. Yes. I can do it. Please do it soon. I gotta take a fucking piss. Can I open the latch and stop? Perhaps I do something with a small tool. Yes, I brought a small tool, motherfucker. Here. God damn. Yes. How about? How about with this fucking tool? Okay, well, next time then, fuck me.